What up, YouTube? It's your boy, Sabio, back again with another reaction video. I know you guys have not seen my face in, like, a week. It's, it's been a lot. I got a lot of stuff going on in my life. Still actually working. Of course, doing YouTube. Dealing with, with the stuff that's happening in my country and community. And I'm remodeling a house, so there's a lot of stuff going on. Thank you to everybody who's being patient with me and who's just been kindly waiting on me to drop another video. And for the people who are even checking in on me to make sure that I was all right. I love you all, I appreciate you. Even thank you to the people who were DMing me and commenting me, screaming at me to release another video because I'm just taking that as you miss me and you love me. I am back. Today we're doing the most requested video on my last video, which was the dance practice for Go Go, like the Halloween one with all the costumes. This was another Halloween dance practice and just like last time, the world still needs some light so we are still putting out light. So this video is going to be super chill. I'm actually going to do in the outro what I did in the last outro. If you have no idea what I'm talking about, that's cool. If you know what I'm talking about, that's great. Anyway, we're going to get into this video and I'll see you guys on the other side. Peace. Okay, so let's let's see who we got here. So clearly that was RM coming down the middle being Winnie the Pooh with fairy wings. I don't know. Uh, and then we have is this Jin right here as a as a cowboy? Okay. Sugar in the back as something I don't know, but I've definitely seen before, and I feel like like people are gonna get on my head when I don't know it because it's it seems important but I don't know what it is and I'm not gonna lie and say that I know what it is but it's it looks super familiar okay and then Hobie as a skeleton that that's what it looks like a skeleton okay he's carrying something but I'm not sure what it is that he's carrying on the end we have V as a sexy French boy, I'm not sure what he is either. These two who are left have to be Jimin and JK. I'm assuming that Kook is the bunny, cause duh, which would make Jimin the the green leafy vegetable. I don't know what he is. I, is is there a Korean version of like Buk Choi? Buk, buk Chow? Buk, buk Choi? Buk. I'm gonna get so roasted this video. Uh, Whatever he is, he's some, some, He's not broccoli, because the, he's broccoli. He's not broccoli. He's like maybe some type of cabbage or something. I don't know. But he looks like one of the, the mascots for a restaurant that I probably would not want to eat at, like a salad and go or, or a, I don't know. Somewhere else they serve salad. I don't really eat salad like that. Pray for me, okay? I, I need help, but I don't know what he is. So um, you know what I'm about to say. You, you know. Nerds. Get to nerding. Tell me what's going on here. I want to know, especially what sugar is and what uh, family of vegetable that I don't eat that Jimin is. Is that a lion that he has in his hand? Or like a care bear? I don't, I'm not sure what, what V is at all. I don't even have a shot in the dark. Like I think, as I said before, that Suga's thing relates to some type of religion or something. Um, but I'm not, or something formal. I don't know if it's necessarily a religion. It might be like some type of like royal attire or something as well. It's Suga, so that might actually make a lot of sense. Now that I think about it. Anyway, point is, V, what are you? Tell me. I'm, I'm kind of bothered. Like, I want to know real, real bad.
This song kind of reminds me of Mic Drop a little bit, which I'm sure will piss a bunch of people off. Whatever. Uh, of the songs that I've heard of them, Mic Drop is like the EDM song that like when if someone said play me a BTS EDM song, that's the song I would go to. This song has a very similar vibe. So far, it seems to be rap heavy. So it's like EDM production paired with rapping which is cool but yeah i'm i'm curious to know who the producer on this was if it was a, a dj or just like you know their normal in-house producers if it was one of them but yeah lots of edm elements in this in the construction of this song <laughs> Jin trying to laugh, or uh, Jin trying to, I'm laughing, Jin trying to turn, but he can't because the horse is smacking up against Hobie is hilarious, priceless. His face is like, bruh, move, let me get around you. Yeah. <laughs> this video, they seem to be uh, like even more silly than the last video, which is probably why you guys recommended me this video on the last video. Maybe it's because the costumes are like so much harder to move in and they're so big and crazy, like Cook. RM Jimin are literally basically head to toe covered in costume and then Jin has like a, a whole person worth of person coming off him. I made a joke about JK being black in the last video. There's a joke about Jin being black in this one. I'm not gonna make it because I don't want to get demonetized but you know where I'm going and if you don't then you're probably not old enough to get it anyway so that's okay. Um, Wow. Wow, this this is the general vibe of the boys is just way, way more playful. Also interested to know what this song is about. You guys told me that the last song was about capitalism, which, wow, okay, did not expect that. There was a subtitle, so I couldn't get a frame of reference on what was going on anyway, but yeah, didn't get that from, from the tone of the song or the tone of the boys. Uh, so this song could literally be about nuclear warfare and I wouldn't know. Is that a reference to that, um, ah, uh, I'm not gonna know the name of it. It's like a, a TikTok where, like, people be, like, fighting, and they, like, stop, and they be like, I don't know if that's what that's a reference to. I don't even know what year this came out. Jeez. I don't know what year that came out. God, I feel so old. Okay. I'm not on TikTok, so I don't even know what that's called. But if you know what I'm talking about, then you'll get why I thought those two things were connected. If they're not connected, then... I don't know what to tell you, Chief. I don't know. I, 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 it happens. But if they are connected, that would be the second Halloween video in a row that I have watched. I don't know if they're, you know, back-to-back -back years. But the second Halloween video that I've watched where the choreography has incorporated popular culture, that is dope. It's like little mini references and also like kind of a time capsule of like, hey, remember when this stuff was cool? Which, in the days of the internet, that comes and goes very quick, but I still think it's cool because uh, I'm I'm a boomer apparently, so no offense to all six boomers who are watching this. We love you because clearly you're not the ones we have the problem with. Oh, that's not what this video is about.
Okay, so yeah, I actually really enjoyed that video a lot. Uh, it was way more silly than I expected it to be. I know it sounds crazy coming into the, the video that I was coming into, but it was. So, eh. okay, now that all of those people are gone and you beautiful people are still here, either the people who are curious based on the intro, which means you watched the intro, thanks, or you were here in the last outro, cause you a real one, Shouts out to you. We're gonna get into the second video, which is the things you didn't notice in the last video. I I really tried to pick up more stuff on this video, to be honest, but I, I don't think I was successful. I noticed a lot of stuff in the other video that I didn't realize I noticed until I was watching this video. So maybe there's some stuff that I either didn't say or just cut out when you guys see it that I actually did notice, but we will see. Thank you for staying for the faux outro and I will see you at the real outro after this. Wait, 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 I gotta go back. I, I, I wanna know, okay? Okay, so I, that, no, that's not what I said. That's, I'm not even gonna try to act like that was close to what I said. I thought he was like a royal or like a part of some religious something. Nah, I was off, I'm sorry. I I will better educate myself in the future for videos that I have not seen yet. P people want me to know everything, bro. I'm sorry, I, I didn't know. I admitted that I did not know though. Honesty is key. Why is he pink princess? Is, is that a is that a nickname or reference to some some what is it called v live I don't know about or some some one of their 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 travel vlogs or something y'all be making references to stuff that like y'all really just be trying to shit on baby army huh because like we we don't be knowing nothing y'all talking about at all and y'all just be making all types of references and memes and jokes include me is what I'm saying I'm jealous is is the point of this rant so um yeah speaking English okay. Sorry, that was that was very aggressive of me. I've been, been going through a lot. Just, just pray for me. Ryan the Bear? Am I supposed to know what that is? He's an anime character. The one person I had no idea who they were was an anime character. The weebs are going to have my head. Okay, in my defense, okay, I have not seen this show at all. I think it's on my mall list, which if you're not a weeb, you have no idea what I'm talking about. It's like a, it's a watch list. It's like my list on Netflix, but for weebs and not on Netflix. And I think I have plans to watch it, but not anytime soon. So, so if it's good, you might want to get to recommending it because, yeah, I'm not, I'm not about to know who this is. But sorry, I promise that I, I can't promise anything. But um, cool fit, bruh. Swag, lit, dab. I know. I'm sorry. Don't click off. Or, or, okay, come back. Come, hey, hey, come back. Hey, I said cabbage. Yeah. Did I say cabbage? I, I feel like I said cabbage if I said a bunch of stuff. So I'm going to make sure I edit it in there. If I said it, I'm going to tell you that because I'm going to be right on this one. Um, cabbage. I know things. <laughs> you didn't have to do cook like that. That was, that was that, I mean, I mean, you're not wrong. Is this video flip? Oh, yeah, 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 in the corner, BTS block. Because when he came in and, like, almost tripped, before it was on, how would you guys see it? I don't know. It's, like, flipped when you guys end up seeing the video. But um, it was on my left side of the screen. So I think your right side of the screen. And now it's flipped, and it's on my right side of the screen. So I 
think your left side of the screen, but I may be right. I may be like, I, not right. I may be wrong. Um, I may be overcomplicating this, but yeah. So they have it flipped. So this is gonna be interesting. <laughs> All right, I just want to I just want to put it out there. RM is a whole mood, bro. This whole video, he got the stank face on, you know what I'm talking about? Whole mood. I noticed that. I noticed that. I don't think I said it, but I, the entire time, Jim is just like, nye, nye, nye. and then like sometimes he's like pulling it down so his head can come out. Sometimes he's just like swimming in it. In the last video, in my Discord, people were asking me, would I rather be dancing in a dress or dancing in big floppy like slipper shoes that they were wearing? And I said the dress because even though I've never danced in a dress and I even said in the video having stuff in, all in between your legs probably be difficult. When I thought about it more, I was like, wait, hold on. V was the only person who actually had real shoes on. The rest of them were in those big floppy death machines. Yes. And almost dying. RM took his shoe off and like threw it at one point. That's terrifying, especially with like all the fast footwork they be doing. And so now, so you don't have to tell me, I'm about to waste a bunch more of your time trying to figure out which of these costumes I'd rather be in. Actually, not a bunch. It's Hobies. It's easy. Like, or I feel like as a weeb, I should say the anime character that I don't know, but he's holding like some little lion thing and he throws it at one point and loses it. I feel like that would be hard to do. Not necessarily the hand-eye coordination of throwing it and catching it. Wow, I'm on a tangent. Just skip ahead a little bit. So not necessarily the hand-eye coordination of throwing it and catching it, but throwing it and catching it and avoiding six other people with flailing limbs and stuff is is scary. So Hobie doesn't throw anything. That might just be a Hobie thing, maybe not a costume thing. I don't know. But in my mind, it's a, it's a costume thing. So we're going to go with it. Wow. See what happens when you don't practice stuff for a long time? I stopped doing this for a week and I just... Start talking about throwing stuff to animals. I don't I don't know what's going on here. You don't either. But we're just, just hey, hey, you, what else would you be doing right now? Okay, okay. So, Hobie, skeleton. He also looks like he's holding something, but he's not in a big mascot costume. And he doesn't have a horse between his legs. And, um, wow. And Sugar literally has, like, all types of stuff flailing around him. He got a hat on, which you have to worry about. That's... That's too much. So it's really, it's just V or Hobie and um, my thought process in trying to ignore the fact that I'm embarrassed that I didn't pick up on the anime character is that I'm going to go with the skeleton. Also, I'm an emo boy. You can't tell right now, but go watch some of my other videos. Emos, we out here. So yeah, skeleton. I wonder if I'm going to leave that in during the editing process. If I do, I'm leaving this in too because this is just, just wow. <laughs>
Okay, hold on. I didn't notice that, like, the entire last video and this video. Hobie is also, he has a skeleton little shibi. So now the question is, am I going to be more of a weeb or more of an emo? Emo, don't get demonetized. Emo guy. Nice. I'm gonna go. I'm. I'm a. I'm a. I'm a. I'm a swap. Cause. Cause I have no spine, and. Uh, cause I want some redeeming quality for this video, and I'm hoping that that the nerds don't kill me. And by the nerds, I mean my Discord, cause they're gonna be on my head for this video. So give me the. I don't even know what the person's name was that he is. Give me the anime cosplay with the little Simba doll and the. Are those Jordans? <laughs> I'll take that, and y'all can deal with the rest of this, cause that, just overall, this seems like it'd be a mess to dance. This is a hazard. They be trying to have the boys break their neck. Like, the, I, I would not, I don't feel safe watching this, let alone being a part of this. Okay, so that, that was a whole mess. I am sorry that you had to get through that, but hopefully you are entertained, because that is the whole point of this video. This was not deep, it's not intellectual. Hopefully it was funny, because if it wasn't, then you just wasted your time. But I enjoyed the videos. I enjoyed the, the things you missed video even more, because it was just a bunch of them being silly and just RM going for it. And, and I, I love that guy, bro, just so much just the video overall was cute it was exactly exactly what i needed i appreciate you guys recommending that and i had fun hopefully you enjoyed this video if not sorry you already watched the whole thing i don't know what to tell you there's no refunds on youtube so yikes but if you did enjoy the video definitely make sure to like comment and subscribe and we will see you next time guys